Hello and welcome to the Timberland Investor. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can remove and replace the clutch of your chainsaw. All you're going to need is your chainsaw, some rope, and a spark plug wrench. Let's do it. Begin by removing the top cover as necessary. Next, we're going to use the spark plug wrench to remove the clutch cover. Before removing the cover, ensure that the chain brake is disengaged. Next, remove the bar and chain. Next, we're going to unplug the spark plug, like so, and remove the spark plug. Use this opportunity to examine the spark plug and see if it needs replacing or cleaning. That should be good. Next, take your rope, tie a little knot at the end, and stick it in the chamber. Get as much as possible in there. What that does is as the clutch turns, it stops the piston and ensures that when you uh, hit it to remove it, it's not just spinning around in a circle. So from there, you can take your spark plug wrench and a hammer, and if you look on the clutch, there is markings that indicate which way is off. And on this chainsaw, it would be uh, clockwise. So I'm going to find the edge there on the inside. I'm just going to give it a couple taps. Might be hard to get the right angle. Just Just like that. And off will come the sprocket, the, uh, the clutch, and from there you can see whatever you need to do. Before you replace it, use this opportunity to clean out anything needs cleaning, which is something I should do more often. When you're ready to replace the clutch, simply do the same thing but in reverse. Screw it in counterclockwise. To seat it, you're going to want to hit it in the opposite direction. Just give it a few light taps. Feels secure. So now we can go about replacing everything. Put the clutch cover back on. Then we can remove the rope, put our spark plug back in, tighten that up, plug it back in, replace the cover.
and we are all set to go. Well, that's really all there is to it. Once you get that done, you're ready to get out there and start cutting again. If you found this video useful, I'd really appreciate it if you gave the like button a hit and subscribe if you want to see more content. Till next time, see you later.